Welcome to Roots Online Abacus Classes. Basics of Abacus. In this lesson, we would learn different components of an abacus and how to read numbers on it. Let us start with components of abacus. There are four components in an abacus. Bar. Columns. Beads. And dots. Let's begin with bar. This horizontal separator is called bar. Next, we have columns. This is a column. This is also a column. Another column. Column. And one more column. All these are columns. Each column shows a one digit number. It means it can show a number from 0 to 9 only. Now we have beads. These are beads. These are also beads. More beads. Each bead has a value which we are going to learn in a moment. Last we have dots. We can see dot here. 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 And here. A dot shows the column with a place value of ones. We will learn more about place values as we move forward. Let us now learn how to read numbers on abacus. Numbers on abacus are shown by beads. Each bead has a value. All the beads above the bar have a value of 5 each. All the beads below the bar have a value of 1 each. We need to remember only two values for all the beads. For upper beads it's 5. And for lower beads it's 1. Let us understand it more clearly with examples. To read a number, we need to see which beads are touching the bar. Do we see any bead touching the bar here? No. No bead is touching the bar. Hence, it means that the abacus is showing number 0. Which bead is touching the bar now? There is one lower bead which is touching the bar. And as already discussed, value of each lower bead is 1. So, the number shown by the abacus is 1. You will also notice that we start the ones place from the dot position and then move towards left for tens, hundreds, thousands and so on. Which beads are touching the bar now? There are two lower beads of value one each which are touching the bar, so the number shown by the abacus is 2. Read the number again. Here we see that three beads of value one each are touching the bar. Hence, abacus is showing number 3. In this example, we see that four beads of value 1 each are touching the bar. It means, abacus is showing number 4. Let's take a few more examples. In this case, we see that one upper bead which is a value 5 is touching the bar. Hence, we can say that the abacus is showing number 5. In this example, we see that one upper bead of value 5 and one lower bead of value 1 are touching the bar. It means the abacus is showing 5 plus 1 which is equal to 6. Here we see that one bead of value 5 and two beads of value 1 each are touching the bar. It means the abacus is showing 5 plus 1, plus 1 which is equal to 7. Read the number again. Here, we see that 1 bead of value 5 and 3 beads of value 1 each are touching the bar. It means the abacus is showing 5, plus 1, plus 1, plus 1 which is equal to 
8. Here, we see that 1 beat of value 5 and 4 beats of value 1 each are touching the bar. It means the abacus is showing 5 plus 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus 1 which is equal to 9. This is the end of the tutorial. Now, complete the exercises given for the practice. We recommend you to clear at least one exercise on daily basis to complete the course successfully. Smartphone is strongly recommended for the best practice, though, you can practice it on your PC, laptops, pads also. After log in to our website, this page will appear. To start practicing, you need to activate input boxes to type your answers which can be done by clicking on the timer button. Answer box will appear in yellow color. Watch the picture carefully to recognize the number shown on the abacus and type your answer. After typing the answer, click the next button. Repeat the process for all the sums. Click result button to see the score. All incorrect answers will appear in red color. You can click refresh button for loading fresh worksheet for the same or next exercise. You need to do all sums correctly and within the specified time to move on to the next exercise. After completing the initial 12 exercises, you need to buy a range of 13 or 17 rods abacus tool for moving further. You can order the same online as well. Thanks for watching the tutorial. See you in the next video.